The pressure is on and opening game nerves can often take hold. Match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. Who will be first to make their mark on the group? Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the 2024 UEFA European Championship. It's Italy and they take on Albania. Well, it's vital that you don't have an off day in these group games. Consistency is key to progressing further in the tournament. I'm looking forward to a hard-fought contest here today, Derek. And the Italy starting 11. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Federico Di Marco. And a creative look about this. Can they forge ahead? And Italy giving the ball away. A look at the opposition starting lineup today. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Italy, the defending champions, up against Spain, Albania and Croatia in Group B. It was slightly against the head when you think about what happened last time out at the Euros, because Italy, of course, had been going through a bad patch. But you almost have to take them seriously every time, don't you? You do, because Italy didn't have a particularly good side under Mancini, but he made them tick, and another manager, Spalletti, could do that all over again. But if you look at their players from 1 to 11, I don't think they're quite good enough to get that far in the tournament. Probably good enough to get out of the group, but they won't go all the way, that's for sure. Well, I really enjoy watching Nicolo Barella. Interested to know what you think he might produce today. Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Well, attacking possibilities and credit is due for that good piece of defending Jorginho Barella Federico Di Marco now with Jorginho Barella it's neat passing confidence on the ball well honestly I didn't mean to jinx them just wasn't a very good pass finally El Saeed Husay Chikaleshi Asani and the attack looks promising but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending Yasir Asani Ramadani Chikaleshi Superbly read and executed Federico Di Marco Raspadori well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Ismaili. Better at Jim Sisi now. Isai. Jim City. Nedim Bayrami. 
Mirto Uzuni by Rami Mitai using his physical strength to shield it Uzuni Ramadani an important interception Raspadori Zaniolo must take the lead here the first half here comes to an end Well, Federico Chiesa is normally such a prominent player out there, but not able to influence this game. Well, he's such a clever player in and around the box, but he just hasn't received it enough in those sort of areas. He's got to work harder to find space for himself, that's for sure. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Chance to play it in. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Fratesi. Oh, a great play. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw in to come. Adiani Smiley. Berat Jim Sisi now. Yassir Asani. Jim Sisi. And a fine tackle. Plenty of options. Ramadani Soko Chikaleshi He continues his run Liber Ramadani He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge Being pressed hard comes to nothing in the end really should have made more of that and they will make the change now Jorginho Federico Di Marco on the ball Bastoni Giorgio Scalvini Nicolo Zaniolo now will they be able to play it in behind the defence well, trying to take their time but not enough care on the ball no let up on the pressing front Jim City El Saeed Hussein and very nicely positioned to win it back well he's certainly not alone decent looking pass spot on with that tackle under pressure here Jim City 
Hisai. Tauland Severi. By Rami. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Soko Chikaleshi. Well, it's a decent looking attack, this. By Rami. Very quick thinking there. Gianluca Scamacca. And they still have designs on the win. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Tauland Seferi. Hisai. Return to Chiesa. Oh, great defending. Well, you just never know about chances near the end. You've got to be opportunistic. Will this corner do it? There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Who can they pick out? Good clearance. Zaniolo. Can they forge ahead? No! And all because of the goalkeeper. Margins, margins. Well, he has done well there, but he should have won the game. They probably won't get another chance now. They take it short. And cutting inside. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Uzuni. Locatelli with it. Alessandro Bastoni. Now with Jorginho. And the pass, a good one. A move of promise. Is it going to end with them scoring the winning goal? defensive intervention there and that will be all for this game anyway no goals to report defenses on top and Stuart as ever interested to get your take well Derek I think it was a good tactical battle there was a lot of endeavor some good defending but not enough attacking quality and that's why we didn't get any goals well impossible to ask footballers to produce magic every single game and it didn't quite happen for him tonight well he struggled to have any real impact didn't he we usually see a lot more from him but I'm sure we'll see a better performance next time out. Let's hope it was just one of those days.